Good morning. Welcome to day four of early childhood music and movement class. I'm so glad you're back with us today. If you were here the other three days, welcome back. And if you weren't here, go to our YouTube and you can watch those classes anytime you like. They're up there for your viewing pleasure whenever it's convenient for you. Today we have a new theme. Let's see, we have done food. The first day was food. The second day was animals. Yesterday was transportation. What do you think today could be? Let's get going and we will find out. But first, I just want to go over the few things, especially for the grown-ups out there, before we get started with the music. If you haven't, make sure you click subscribe and turn on the notification bell on YouTube for McKee Music Therapy. And also go to Facebook, McKee Music Therapy, and click follow there. We are going to do a giveaway tomorrow for a drum, a really cool drum. So you wanna make sure you're subscribed on YouTube and following on Facebook to be qualified to win the drum. And I think that's about it. If you have some instruments today, um, get those out or visit your kitchen and get your mixing bowls with your wooden spoons. And if you have some lovies or a blanket to do a parachute time, that would be great too. Here we go. think today's theme could be? Hmm, it's something that happens outside and sometimes it's cold, sometimes it's hot. Oh, what do you think it could be? Today is all about weather. If you look out your window today, why not on the count of three, tell me what the weather is like at your house today. One, two, three. Oh, interesting. We are out in Los Angeles and it is a sunny day here. Odds are if you come to Los Angeles, it will be sunny. It rains every once in a while, but that's unusual. And we don't really get snow except in the mountains. And um, usually it's sunny, which is nice because we have a beach and we have Disneyland and all those fun things to explore. So if you're ever out in Los Angeles, be ready for sun. Anyways. Today, we are doing weather and the things that we do out in different types of weather. Let's see. Let's think of some songs. Anyone know some songs about rain? I know, especially where um, some of our relatives lives, live in the Midwest or back east. It rains a lot more than it rains here. And sometimes you're just sick of the rain and you want to go outside and play. So this is a good song to sing during that time. It's, oh, rain, rain, go away, come back in another day. My friend Ashley wants 
to play. Rain, rain, go away. We can put in whoever we want in that song. You can put your name in it. You can put your brother or sister's name in it. You can put your mom or dad or your best friend. Here we go. Let's try it with a few different names. Here we go. Rain, rain, go away. Come again another day. My friend Parker wants to play. Rain, rain, go away. And we're going to do it one more time. Let's see. Who on my list can I put? Rain, rain, go away. Come back in another day. My friend Escher wants to play. Rain, rain, go away. That is a good one to sing when you are tired of the rain and you want to go outside to play. It's fun sometimes to go out and play in the rain. I know my kids like to put on the rain boots and jump in puddles because it's so unusual to rain here. But those of you who live where it rains a lot might be tired of jumping in puddles. Here's another rain song. It's raining, it's pouring, the old man is snoring. He bumped his head and he went to bed and couldn't get up in the morning. or a mixing bowl with a wooden spoon. Get it out right now. Thankfully, mine is sitting right next to me. I've got all the other instruments that are inside of it. Here we go. So if you have a drum, I have this really fun drum with animals and trees on it. But whatever you drum you have will be great. And you can use a bowl. You can use some plastic bowls. You can even just use your lap as a drum. It's a great drum that is always with you. So this one is to the tune of Are You Sleeping? But we can put all the different um, weather things in it. So let's start with thunder. Who here has ever heard thunder? It is loud. It doesn't happen too often here, but sometimes it does and startles us because it's so loud. But we're going to make some weather on our drum today. So get your drum out or get your mixing bowl or get your lap ready with your hands. Here we go. We are going to start with thunder. We go. Let's see. Hmm. Would this sound like thunder? No. Would this sound like thunder? No. Hmm. Thunder. We have to be loud. You ready? I hear thunder. I hear Now we're gonna make the rain. Pitter patter rain drops, pitter patter rain drops. I'm wet through, I'm wet through. Now let's see, what other weather could we put on our drum? Hmm, any ideas out there? What about rain? <gasps> I hear rain, I hear rain. Oh, don't you, oh, don't you. Pitter patter rain drops, pitter patter rain drops. I'm wet through, I'm wet through. Now, lately, we've had something near our house that makes the trees sway and blow. Do you know what that is? Wind. That's right. Now, how do you think we could make some wind on this drum? Any ideas? We could, could we blow? Can't really hear it too loud. Sometimes we take our hand and we rub the drum. Let me put it up so you can hear it a little better. Does that sound like wind to you? So take your hand, rub it on your drum, or if you're using your lap, you can rub your hands together. That makes a good wind sound. Here we go. I hear wind, I hear wind, oh, don't you? Oh, don't you? Let's bring those raindrops back in. Pitter patter raindrops, pitter patter raindrops. I'm wet through, I'm wet through. Let's see. Hmm. Is there anything else we can think of? I really like the thunder. Let's do thunder one more time because it's fun to be loud on the drums. I hear thunder, I hear thunder. Oh, don't you? 
Oh, don't you pitter patter raindrops, pitter patter raindrops. I'm wet through. I'm wet through. Let's give a little rumble on the drum. And stop. Good job. Thank you for helping me out making the weather on there. Now there is another song that is an old, old nursery rhyme, but we're going to try singing it now so you can learn it. And it's about what do you do with all this great weather? You have sun, you have rain. Sometimes we like to plant a garden in the sun and rain because the sun and the rain help those plants grow and it's fun to grow some flowers or vegetables or fruit. We did some oats, peas, beans, and barley growing on our food day. But today we're gonna do a garden because it's fun to plant a garden in the sun and the rain. Um, you know what, this is a song I haven't done in a long time, so I actually have my notes next to me. Sometimes we have to have our notes because we haven't done something in a long time. Mary, 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 quite contrary, how does your garden grow? With silver bells and cockle shells and pretty maids all in a row. Has anyone heard that song? It's one of the ones that we don't hear as often. I do know when I was a little girl, and if you live in the Bay Area where I grew up, there is a place in Oakland called Fairyland. And it is so fun because it has all the different fairy tale stories and different things you do in the fairy tales. And I remember seeing this um, nursery rhyme there. But it is not a common one, so let's try it again. Mary, Mary, quite contrary, how does your garden grow? Silver bells and cockle shells and pretty maids all in a row. I like that one. It is fun. Now, we are going to get up and do some dancing. Because sometimes it gets a little tiring just sitting down. I'm going to move over my instrument. And I'm going to back up the computer here. We did a song earlier this week on the food day where we did I'm a Little Teapot. There is another version of that song. I'm going to move this up. And this version is one you can use when it's snowing or when you're talking about snow. Oh, let me move this up so you can see my head. I'm very tall, so I have to make that up pretty tall. And we say, I'm a little snow. Like, you know what? I'm going to put my guitar down because I'm just going to teach you the moves to it. You ready? I'm a little snowman, short and fat. Here is my scarf, wrap your scarf around your head. And here is my hat, you got it? When I see the snow fall, hear me shout. All you children, please come out. You ready? Get on up and try it with me. Let's be a nice fat snowman. Who here, raise your hand if you have made a snowman. That is always fun to do. I love to make snowmans when we're when we're at the snow. Here we go. I'm a little snowman, short and fat. Here is my scarf and here is my hat. When I see the snowball, hear me shout. All you children, please come out. Let's do it one more time. I love to pretend that I I'm a snowman or lots of different things. It's fun to use our imagination. I'm a little snowman, short and fat. Here is my scarf and here is my hat. When I see the snow fall, hear me shout. All you children, please come out. Great job. Now, I'm going to see if my kids are paying attention. Gabrielle, are you around? Um, let me see if they're gonna come. I have a dance to show you that deals with weather. And so we are gonna, let me put this up a little. When you're three, sometimes you don't wanna do things, so that's okay. We're gonna hold hands and we're gonna circle around in a circle. And this is what a song about cold and frosty mornings we go. Here we go round the mulberry bush, the mulberry bush, the mulberry bush. 
Here we go round the boat, right? Wish on a cold and frosty morning. And then we pretend all the things we do when we get up in the morning. What do we first do? This is the way we comb our hair, comb our hair, comb our hair. This is the way we comb our hair on a cold and frosty morning. Let's grab hands, let's go the other way. We don't want to keep getting dizzy going one way all the time. Here we go round the mulberry bush, the mulberry bush, the mulberry bush. Here we go round the mulberry bush on a cold and frosty morning. This is the way we put on our clothes. Put on our clothes, put on our clothes. This is the way we put on our clothes on a cold and frosty morning. Here we go round the mulberry bush, the mulberry bush, the mulberry bush. Here we go round the mulberry bush, cold and frosty morning. This is the way we eat our breakfast, eat our breakfast, eat our breakfast. This is the way we eat our breakfast on a cold and frosty morning. This is the way, oh, here we go round the mulberry bush, the mulberry bush, the mulberry bush. Here we go round the mulberry bush on a cold and frosty morning. Thank you. That was fun. And that is an old game that kids played a long time ago. But I'm going to keep Gabrielle here. If you brought your little blanket to use as a parachute today, we'll use that right now since she's already here with us. Don't step on the drum behind you. And if you have any stuffed animal friends, I'm going to use our puppets that we used the other day for animals. And let's see. We are going to do a little game and have our animal friends enjoy the time on the parachute. You ready? I'm going to remember the words. Here we go. Rain. Let me get it up here so you can see. Gary, you want to scoot in so you're in the picture so they don't think you just have arms? Here's our animals. Here we go. Rain on the green grass, rain on the tree, rain on the housetop. We got to get those animals off, but not on me. There we go. Let's try it again. Put those animals back on the parachute. Here we go. Rain on the green grass, rain on the tree, rain on the housetop, but not on me. There we go. Let's do it one more time. Everyone seems to always like throwing things off the parachute. So we'll get it done one more time. You ready? Rain on the green grass, rain on the tree, rain on the housetop, but not on me. There you go. Good job. Get them all off. Make sure they're all off. Oh, it's empty. There we go. Let's move these over to the side. Thank you, Gabrielle, for joining us today. You're welcome. And tomorrow, if I can convince one of my kids, or maybe two of them, to share some of their music with you, what? they both are really good at their instruments. One is not with us right now because she is on her Zoom meeting um, with her trumpet class, with her band class. Um, so let me see what we have here. Oh, the next one. We're going to put out our hand, and we're going to plant a garden on our hand in the sunshine. Here we go. So put out your hand. It's kind of to the tune of Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Here we go. This is my garden. I'll rake it with care. Use your fingers and rake that dirt. Here we go. And then some flowers I'll plant in there. Put those flowers in. The sun will shine and the rain will fall. And my garden will blossom straight and tall. There you go. You ready to plant a garden on your hand? This is my garden. I'll rake it with care. And then some flower seeds I'll plant in there. The sun will shine and the rain will fall. And my garden will blossom straight and tall. That's a fun one, isn't it? That was a newish one to me as well. So, anyways, we have done a lot of weather things today, haven't we? And we are almost done today. Oh, 
we are going to sing our goodbye songs. And we are going to just want to give you a couple reminders. So let's do what was your favorite part of music first. And then we'll give you the reminders and then sing goodbye. What was your favorite part of music? What was your favorite part of music? What did you like? What did you like? What was your favorite part of www.mckeemusictherapy.com It explains all about music therapy and the great things it can help you with. And there's a contact us page there as well. You can email us. You can call us. We're always here to guide you. If you have anyone that is on an IEP in school districts, we are considered a related service by federal law and can be put on IEP. So if you need help with that, guiding your... Um, guiding you on how to ask your IEP team for music therapy for your child, feel free to reach out. I will be happy, or one of us will be happy, to walk you through that. We are on in lots of districts. And if you are not in California, that is okay, too. We also utilize teletherapy. Here we go. It's time for us to go. It's time for us to go.